All right, well, anyway, this is Jedi 2323. I'm uh, leaving you this video because I, I haven't really uploaded any videos, but I figured I couldn't wait too long. I don't have any computers or nothing, so you guys are going to have to keep up with me. The reason why I'm sending this video out is because of all of you people that are stuck on 3.13 firmware, can't figure out how to get a jailbreak, been stuck here for days running around trying all different programs, you're having a hell of a time. It's uh, been a lot of BS on our parts trying to figure out how to get everything unlocked. Um, I, what I want you to do, uh, there is an unlock for the carrier for the 51201 baseband. They say that there is not one, but there's been one that's been lost a while back in the mix, and I'm going to tell you exactly where it's at. This will hopefully clear up any confusion you have of anything. I want you to start fresh out of your mind. Don't even think about snow breeze. Don't think about um, red snow. Don't think about black rain. Just clear all that out from your mind. And just try to keep up with me here, okay? All right, first off, what you're going to do is you want to do a full restore in, in your iTunes. Uh, this video is probably going to be better off for people that have already recently been messing with their iPhones or have done this process before. Restore your phone in uh, iTunes back to the 3.13 firmware if you haven't done so already. Um, go ahead and once the full restore is done, exit out of iTunes. Uh, go ahead and search the web and you're looking for this... Uh, this uh, place, it's uh, spirit, S-P-I-R-I-T dot J-B dot com. It's a spirit jailbreak dot com. If you have any problems, you should be able to find it. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory. That's the new jailbreak that's out for the 3.13. This is the new boot ROM. Okay, guys? And uh, you go ahead and it'll unlock, I've been told, the iPad. It'll unlock the 3G, 2G, anything running on the 3.13. All right, so... You go ahead and uh, go ahead and run through the link there. It'll let you know what uh, what operating system you have. If it's Windows, if it's going to be your Mac. So uh, self-explanatory there. Download it, roll it to your desktop, open the program. Now, when I was using this program, people said that you might have a problem. You have to go uh, right-click to your properties on it, and then change it to. Uh, system to be compatible with Windows 95 slash ME, I believe that's what it is, or 98 slash ME. This did not work for me. For some reason, I kept getting an error, and some of you guys might have an error saying your Windows, uh, you need to upgrade iTunes to a 9.0 version, even if you're running a 9.0 version. It was very frustrating. I was very, very pissed off about it. After sitting for a while and figuring it out, um, I didn't have to change anything. I left everything just the way it was. I unchecked all the stuff that I was told to check. You can check other videos if you have any problems. I uh, don't have a troubleshooting video out or anything for you. So hopefully the spirit jailbreak will go well for you. It's very easy. You just click, kind of like Black Rain. It's one little box. You click it. Jailbreak process should start. You should see the spirit flash logo on your screen. Uh, once it's done running, you should have Cydia application and your phone is now jailbroken. Very simple, very easy to use. It's just like Black Rain. Um, better than Black Rain because of the fact that it is not tethered. The 3GS is not tethered, uh, which is way awesome. That tethering crap sucks. Uh, lost a couple phones to it from re jailbreaking too many times. Um, well, I didn't lose phones, but I had to restore so many times. But anyway, so now we got this phone jailbroken, and you're good. You got City application. If you want to unlock it, it's very easy. We're going to be using Purple Snow. Purple Snow, if you look at the date of this video, uh, it is being released today. So, therefore, you know that I'm not just an older video that's talking about some crap that ain't going to happen. Purple Snow has uh, been lost for some reason a month ago. Uh, it's uh, accessed by Cydia, so once you go into Cydia and open it, you might have to let it load the first time through if you're opening it. <sighs> Get back into Cydia, open it up again. Once it loads, go to, go to Manage, go to your Sources, go Manage, Edit, and then Add in the top right-hand corner. Once it gives you the URL, the hot tip of what to add in there, type this in. Apt apt dot geohot g e o h o t dot c o m. It'll load that package in there. It's the geohot package, and you should have one item inside that package. Once that package, you open it up, and uh, you have the one item in there. Go ahead and run it, install it. 
it'll uh, flash off your AT&T or whatever provider you're using or even if you're not using a provider it'll slash for a minute and then it'll say it, it might say that it couldn't find anything that's just because it's running slow um, I put mine in my sim card in and, in and it unlocked it just fine so if you guys are having any problems with this uh, unlock I don't see why you would because I didn't and I have everything on the new boot ROM uh, I hope this video helps you guys out uh, one last kicker I wanted to give you guys once you fo your phone is unlocked completely and you can use any carrier uh, I've been doing a lot of studying on to-go phones and uh, through AT&T however the prices are way too expensive they're 25 cents a minute you have to activate the chip outside the phone get AT&T to do it buy a go phone all this other crap in order to use it and it really sucks it's not worth the price um, I recommend what I'm using right now is called an O2 wireless SIM card. You can get them at Best Buy for only $9.99 at Best Buy. It's called a universal SIM card, O2 wireless. And that will run you $0.12 cents a minute It'll get, or 13 or something like that. It'll cut your bill completely in half for what you're using unless you want to do an unlimited plan and you have access to do that if you want to. So you go ahead and get the $9.99 uh, chip from Best Buy. It'll give you $7 free. You'll give yourself a brand new phone number. You don't have to talk to any operators like AT&T. Verify any ICMI numbers, any of those things. All you have to do is call it in, verify the chip. They'll give you a new phone number. Bam, you're in. You're done. Unlocked, jailbroken within just a few minutes. Don't let this video complicate you guys at all. I know without a computer it's been it's very hard but I, I I wanted to make sure that you guys know that there is a way to unlock and jailbreak the 3.13 we're not waiting any longer here for this to come out I've been uh, really happy because I was stuck on the 3.13 for at least a month now trying to figure this out and I didn't want to wait any longer and thank God that I kept with it and stuck with it and I'm just telling you guys that I've uh, I found the trick around it so go ahead and uh, Email me. Uh, hopefully, I can get my email here on the on uh, somewhere on the page. Um, I'd love to help you out if you have any problems. If you do have the error uh, in the Spirit jailbreak, you have the error code C00005, I believe it is. I've never witnessed that, but um, that might be where you have to actually change the settings to the 98 slash ME in your properties before you run the jailbreak program. It might be easier if you uh, run the jailbreak program as an administrator. I didn't, but uh, you might want to. It'd be just another troubleshooting uh, error for you guys. Hope this works out. Um, hope that uh, I see you guys in the future on more videos when I get back on my feet with the computers and stuff. Be able to show you different videos, free text messaging, free you know calls, stuff like that. All right, YouTube. Hope this is helpful. Uh, get back to me. All right, peace out.